Fox Good, it's your boy Mikey Pipes. We up in here at the business end of the PX2 Grand Final event, end of the world. We already had some sick battles. We're about to get into another crazy battle. I won't even fuck around. Let's introduce the battler to my left. Give it up for Addict. Yeah. 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 Happy Addict, yeah. Emma. Happy birthday to Chevy for last week, and shout out to my grandpa, Toki Combs. That's what's good, and his opponent in this battle, give it up, battler to my right, Mason. What's up, yeah. Mason? Yeah. 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 fucking freedom, bitch, yeah! yeah. yeah. Oh, don't, Mason. We already flipped a coin. Mason's won the toss. He's chosen for James Attic Brown to go first. Hold it down, respect the MCs. How are we, Melbourne? Yeah. 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 We all drunk? Yeah. Yeah. Alright. So I'm ready to die. I'll experience life after death when I come up victorious. Mace was locked up, so he acts like a bad boy, but he'll never be notorious. Yo, so I'ma double up and murder Mace, cause I never heard a good Mace song. Come, I'd never collab with you, cause I'd never make a track that I'd let Mace on. Yo, real talk, he was locked in prison. So I heard he signed an obscene statement and listed offenders as he named them at the police station for a cheap payment of a couple of years off so he wouldn't be raped and snitching was the only way Lee became a Freemason. Yo, your music is shot. You take drugs to comprehend that you're losing at life and he's on his Disney tip the way he gets goofy on ice. <laughs> This fucking bitch is twice my age, but I got twice the skill, so of course I'll take the bloody win. And yes, I'm gonna rub it in when you're old enough to be my father, but I'm the one son and him. Yo, everything I just said, ignore it. Pretend I didn't say them lines. They were a waste of time, because this Mason guy, he battled in station. Time. <laughs> And he's addict, he's right! I'm about those billies and crystals on the couch, just like Robert De Niro. So you all can analyse this and publicly watch my cushion blows. You are just like a knobhead bitch, as well as a menstruating bitch. The way in your last battle you are simultaneously sucking dick, as well as push and flow. And you know it's all an act, right? How he pretends to rap and bust hard? Why don't you try that push and shit with me, you fat little fucktard? Yeah, you won't. You won't. Because you're a fat little loser who looks like he just lost his gimp mask. Plus, you don't have the balls to bump me. And your mum's pussy is so fat and wide, it's had so many roots inside, you could call that area its own country. See, I'm kind of here, but I'm pissed off that we've even been pinholed on this dumb shit card. Mikey, that's if you ask me. If you tried to grow a beard like this, it'd look like a young blonde chick's ass cheeks. <laughs> and this battle ain't a task, see? You don't even smoke grass, Cheech, so you are not an addict, bro. I just had to tell you right. I sell fat grams to my bros and buds, but it ain't good if we were bros and you wanted buds, everything I'd sell you light. No? Oh. I'd love to be like... It's just puppy fat, but that's just whack dog. Cause I bet you my cat or dog that when this rat gets to my age, he's still a fucking fat slob. So whenever Mason takes a win, he's probably robbing a cunt. I did push flow, but for the shit he talked on the internet, I should have bottled the cunt. Yes. Yeah. I've always got them nice lines packing like an ice pipe addict. Nice eyes, faggot, with the contacts you trying to bite Hobson but end up looking like a twilight faggot. Oh. Oh. Alright, so you probably got raped when you're you when you're in prison, you probably got raped, maggot. They should have locked you in a straight jacket, but he didn't fit the criteria. He is a gay faggot. Yo! So they let you out of prison? They probably should have left you inside it. And the showers dudes were literally getting behind him till his ass resembled some form of elephantitis mixed with the genital virus. My bars are intelligent. Shit, I could study medical science to pass every assignment. So I'm smart enough to not make fun of Mason for being locked in the mental asylum. I drink so much, they reckon I'm Irish. I reckon you got arthritis. You're older than Jeremy Irons. Yo. 
older than Jeremy Irons. When it, this pillow bed, but I would rather jump in the bed with some minors and have sex with vagina. That makes me angry, because when it comes to boys, he prefers them in diapers. That gets me ready for violence. With the lines that I'm writing, I'll leave Mason's mind blowing dead and in silence like I was Kennedy Sniper. Time. Give it up for that round. Yo, the way you wear a jersey every battle really has me feeling ripped off. Because I bet this fat little cunt circumcision was the last time he really saw a tip off. Oh. And your dick is soft and small, so let's confess, you'll be embarrassed after this raping like Kobe at that famous press conference. Oh. Yo. And you'll be embarrassed by, like Kobe at that famous press conference. Oh. And I fucking forgot my bars. I've only been out for one week, but this cunt's fucking weak, and he's got some mad titties, they're probably double D's. So I'm talking some old some Bliss Nesso, when I see him bouncing in front of me, I spent the last three days just sitting by the sea, so fucking sue me. Yeah. Right, yeah. real MC shit. Just talking on some freestyle. Fuck you, and I will fuck your mum's gums. I'll get her so horny she'll want to play with my plums. I'll, I'll get fucking, I'll get your mum so fucking stoned she'll call me Toki Cones, and she'll never leave me alone like a Macaulay Culkin in Home Alone. <laughs> He's looking at his bars, but in round one, he made some lines about name play on my on my name addict. Enough said. How are you gonna bag me for my name when you got the same name as Mason Callum, fuckhead? <laughs> Yo, I rhyme sick. I'm violent by design, bitch. Like Jedi mind tricks with my disses. Addict like Genghis Khan. I'll stab this wide bitch with a nice pick. My mind's sick and wicked. Mason's chances of being an addict, not in the slightest, not the slimmest. Yo, you love drugs too much. You can never kill an addict like Walt Walter White did to his side, kicks, misses. Yeah. I don't actually expect anyone to get this rhyme scheme, but Mason, you cannot fuck with my steeds. You look like that guy, lean or I, free if they were 90 or an ice fiend. And I'm not just talking drugs when I say every night he might drink his life be revolved around pipes, see? Every time this guy sees Dirty Mac, he tags on like it's my key. Yo! This entire scene is getting sick and tired, beat of how you dick ride, jeez. You pikey, you're a right sleaze. Your whole life concedes of lines, E, bit of light, sleep, highs, weed, fine, lee, some ice, and speed. So Mason, tell me. How are you gonna kill me when you can't even beat your own addict inside, G? Woo! Now to get a little bit of freestyle shit going. Anyone play COD? So, Black Ops. So, when you were in the mental asylum, they probably brainwashing you. Getting you to do the evil deeds without actually telling Mason. Next thing you know, the President of the US will turn up dead. And he'll change his name to Alex Mason. Time. Oh, on, Mason. Give it up for that round. <laughs> Yo. Go, Mason. He's right, man. He's right. He's right. I, I do love drugs, yeah? And I've held those bath salts in my palm like a fine young cannibal and drove myself crazy. Oh, fuck. And I'm going to fuck up my third round as well and have to freestyle, baby. That's just what we do. That's just what we do. One ounce. What? And I was really digging that line before about a butter knife. I was gonna get on stage and not fucking stutter, right? I was gonna deliver a rebar perfectly in Carpy's fat fucking head. But this is what I'm gonna fucking do instead. So I hope you enjoy it. I'm just here to give props to the league. And any motherfucker who'd like to step up and speak over me, please. You don't have the keys. And I'm trying to find my bars. Nah, let me just say this, you're a fat fucktard. Yo, yo, yeah, yo. And it is like too many burgers. You know, old McDonald had a farm until his fat cunt ate all the animals. <laughs> 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 Drugs, 
mugs one more time and I will straight fist fuck your belly button. <laughs> and that'll do that's all you get for free time, mace. Cheers. Yeah. We're gonna get the results straight in. First of all, I gotta get. Yeah. To my boys at LMG Studio for holding us down with all the tech support. Of course, I gotta give shout outs to my homies, Southside Custom Inc. I gotta give shout outs to my homies at Battle Gear Clothing, OzHipHopShop.com, and Subtle Design Studios. Hey, hold it down! We got the result, let's give it up for the winner of that battle, Addict! Give it up! Yeah. Well, that's cool as shit, we're gonna kill it next year. <laughs> Briggs, March team at Briggs the UK, uh, just judged Addict and Mason. Pretty good battle, Mason had a couple of slips in the second and third, I think if he may have kept up with it, like, the stamina that he had in the first, he may have took it, but Addict was just too consistent over the, the three rounds. Couple corny lines from both each way, I'm not going to lie, but I think Addict had the better wordplay, the better metaphors, and just straight up killed the battle, so yeah, 2-1, Addict, Briggs, March team, DFAFD, let's go. Maddie again, um, yeah, fucking Addict took that out, easy. Yo, what up, it's Barry Bonza, uh, just judged Addict versus Mason at the PX2 final. Uh, Mason didn't come with his uh, A game on the prep this time. Um, he was wearing those crazy contacts, so I was thinking big things for the end of the world, you know, he loves to do all that shit, but it uh, didn't pan out. His freestyles were fucking hilarious. Addict stepped up his game today. Um, Still a little bit of inconsistency with flow, the way he does his patterns, but um, he had some of the heavier hitting lines, aside from the, the funny Mason freestyles, but I thought he technically structured his stuff a whole lot better, uh, so I gave it to Addict 2-1.